you could have saved Michael or Kate, and you chose Kate. Carly, I don't blame you for Is that what happened? I saw a rifle, Carly, and I reacted. You put our son in the line of fire to save Kate. Yes! Piecing together exactly what happened here. Yeah, well, you better get to work, and you better find proof that Sonny left his 12-year-old boy alone and unprotected, and that's why he was shot. Carly, it happened very quickly. You there shut your mouth to... because you took my kid to that warehouse. I wanted to help Michael. You wanted to help yourself to Sonny. So you took my kid somewhere you knew was dangerous. Don't yell at her. I'm the one to blame. You bet you're the one to blame. You were the most selfish man I've ever met. You only think about yourself or your trophy of the moment. Carly. You decided you're in love with Kate, so anything and everything goes out the window? Including your kid? I was wrong! What do you want me to say? I love my kids! You saw a rifle. And Michael and Kate were standing there, and who did you instinctively protect? Kate! Michael didn't even cross your mind. I would do anything for Michael. Except love and protect him! You swore to me. You swore to me that you were going to protect him and keep them safe. And when his life was on the line, you didn't give it, and Michael was disposable. Really, don't say that. Shut your mouth! You don't care about Michael. You only care about who you're sleeping with at any given moment. You don't deserve to be a parent, and you are not Michael's father anymore. You were right when you tried to hide Christina from Sonny. I called you paranoid. I called you overprotective. But you were trying to be a good mother. Not like me. I failed my kid. You didn't fail him, Carly. Oh, yeah, I did. Sonny's poison. And I knew it. I ignored it. And now Michael's paying for it. I never wanted Michael to get hurt, Carly. You right? know that. Yeah, because you made some kind of bargain with the Zakaras. And then you went to Michael and you said, guess what, son? I made peace with my enemies. So now we're all going to be safe. And he said, that's great, Dad. Why? Because he trusted you. Because he's a sweet, innocent boy who believed in you and who believed that you were going to protect him. I wanted to show Michael that he can live without violence right, for the first time ever, pretty much, yeah. right? And you thought you could just snap your fingers and the danger would leave. You risked your son's life on wishful thinking, Sonny. How many times do I have to say it? I was wrong! Oh, you don't give a damn about your kid, Sonny, except when you want to pull him out as little badges and use them to pretend that you're some kind of a good father. Okay, you know what? You can hate me all you want, but don't you ever tell me that I don't love my kids. If you loved Michael, you would have saved him. This needs to stop. You have a little boy in there that needs you both. Yeah, that's my little boy in there. He's not Sonny's son. Don't you come here, Michael, again. Sonny was here. And he brought Kate. I left them alone so they could have some time with Michael. And when I came back, Alexis was here with a detective and they were asking him questions about the shooting. Go on. I don't know if you want to hear this, Jason. I don't know if you want your heart to break any more than it's breaking. And it's my fault. Just tell, tell, me, what, tell me what happened. Sonny saw the rifle. He knew the shot was coming. And he pushed Kate out of the way. He let Michael stand there. Michael was unprotected. The man I 
Michael's already been paying for my choices, Jason. I mean, if it hadn't been this, it was just going to be something else. You have been the best mother you can be. Oh, come on. My life has been a train wreck. Whenever something good happens, I find a way to screw it up. That's how I got involved with Sunny in the beginning. Don't, don't, don't do this to yourself, right? Oh, come on. I have to do this. I got to take a long look in the mirror and see that this is my fault. I, I self-destructed and I cheated on you by crawling into bed with Sunny. That's where it all began. Michael was in the warehouse with Sonny. Not you. You're the one who wanted to go get him. I, I stopped you from... Sonny into Michael's life and I made him his father. I set my son on the path that led him to this hospital bed. Jason, this is all on me. He's my baby. It's on me to protect him. I'm just trying to hold on to something Monica told me. She said my decisions. I didn't really know what I was doing in the beginning with Michael, you know? Jason, that works for you, but not for me. What are you talking about? You did the best you could for him. I took this kid wherever I wanted to go. I did what was good for me, and then I justified it by telling myself that it was good for him. You couldn't know how this was going to turn out. And if I would have been honest with myself, I would have admitted that Sonny wasn't a good father. He never would have been. You made a mistake. And you would have never made that mistake in a million years. Sonny does what's good for Sonny. Whatever makes Sonny happy. Whether it be the girlfriend at the time, the power, everyday violence. It's always there. And I knew it, Jason, I knew it. But then I fell in love with Sonny and I ignored it and I pushed it away. And I have stories that Sonny was such a great man. I'm such a great liar. I even convinced myself. And the work got me. My son's in a coma. Come on. You, you could not know the future. saw you in the warehouse, he should have put his gun away. He should have... He should have left. He should never have taken a chance. It never occurred to me that you would be there with your father, and it should have, because... I've been there, myself. 
don't know what it's like to grow up in a world full of violence. It's a bunch of adults who don't give a damn. I never wanted to do that to another person. But I have. I'm so sorry, Michael. This was my mother's. You hold on to it for me, okay? You get the hell away from my son. On the next General Hospital. You're choosing that life over me and the boys. I have failed my son. Michael needs you. I'm really sorry. Michael's fighting for his life because of people like you. Get out! Watch weekdays on ABC, weeknights on SoapNet.